the Justice Department reopened a 49-year-old case of the death of Emmett Till, a 14-year-old boy who were brutally killed. Emmett was murdered for allegedly whistling at a white girl. This 49-year-old saga is now being retold to the world. The saga began on a warm August night. Emmett was kidnapped at gunpoint without putting up a fight. For Emmett's alleged offense, he was brutally beaten and tied down by an industrial fan, a typical method used by the local Ku Klux Klan. A trial ensued charging two half-brothers looking for justice was the victim's mother. But after 67 minutes, the two brothers were set free. He returned home to have a cold beer under a cool Mississippi tree. Two months later, the truth was told from the accused on mouth. Sold a story to Look Magazine, where they began to spout. They spoke of how Emmett stood steadfast and strong never a many of doing anything wrong. But the two brothers took Emmett's fearlessness as a sign of defiance, killed him in the name of Jim Crow and what they believed to be in compliance. The horror of the crime shocked much of the nation but not in the South, where there's still cotton plantations. <laughs>